What's up, I'm Trevor Wallace, and today we're gonna be reading fuckboy texts. Not from me, but I do send a lot. Here we go, this is a random DM that somebody sent. I wanna stick my tongue so far up your ass I can taste the shit other dudes put you through. <laughs> That's like a high coupon, bro. That's like Shel Silverstein shit right there. Does it make it any better that I regret everything immediately after sending that dot, 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 question mark? You can't apologize. You gotta double down. You can't be like, yo, I'm trying to do anal on top of a roof. I'm kidding. I don't got a roof. You gotta commit. Here we go. Here's a good text. When are we meeting up? Now. Now. With a bunch of O's. If not, O. Oh. Is it cool if I come in a half an hour? Question mark. Sorry, they started playing Nickelback. This is the drunkest conversation I've ever read. Everybody's hammered in this. And I can tell because... The now, that's the horniest now I've ever seen. Now! Fucking so horny. Sorry, they started playing Nickelback. Whoever was on the other side of that, I probably wouldn't answer their text after that. Creed, different story, all right? Oh, this is gonna be a girl, because I know they started off with question. If I push this flight back, would you come over? No text back. My friends guilted me into going. I wanted to delay a day for sex. Apparently my friends didn't see that as a suitable reason. I disagree. All I know is it's $75 on JetBlue to change your flight, so that dick game must be worth $75. So shout out to that dude, whoever's laying pipe. That one's actually a dude. That was? That was a dude? That's a desperate ass dude right there. Well, wow, shout out to whoever's fucking, whatever girl that was. To delay a fight? That, to delay a flight, that's some good ass right there. Like, you don't ever need a compliment in your life. You can wear a trench coat for the rest of your life, because all you know is that you got that delayed flight pussy, which is, the best in the game. Oh, this one is in a different language, it looks like. <laughs> okay. This is from Tinder because it says, you match with Kevin. Oi, mate, you look like my stepmom. Oof. And then the fucking drool emoji. I hate that drool emoji. That emoji is horny as fuck for no reason. Whoever made that at Apple, seek sex. And then the response was, ha ha, excuse me? <laughs> this is what I love. He doubles down. He goes, you heard me. Next message. I'm sure you can only guess my Pornhub history. <laughs> and then he put the huh face with the family emoji. As sick as this fuck Kevin is, I love that he tripled down. He even threw in the emoji. It's like playful, but also like a little too much on the incest side. Oh, this is desperate. This, oh my. Anytime it's all on one side without anybody interjecting on this side, lonely. Here we go. Hey, smiley face. Next one. How have you been? I haven't talked to you in so long. Well, she hasn't fucking talked to you either, so that makes two of you. Hi, happy birthday. If you say happy birthday and don't get a text back, or even the thumbs up, and he goes, hey, sad face. No, we know you're sad. You don't need to put the sad emoji. This is great. Hey, want to go out and play 18 holes of golf, then come back to my place and make it 21? I mean, if you're gonna go out with a banger, save the headliner for last. If you don't respond to that, then you're just a dick. That's funny. That, that even got me, and I didn't even see that one coming. Got another lonely ass dude. If you send more than two messages and don't get a text back, jerk off. You'll feel better, I promise. First message, hey, how's your day going? Next, hey, <laughs> gonna think about maybe answering me back sometime soon? Oh yeah, that's why she wasn't. She wasn't thinking about it. Uh, guess not. The fingers crossed emoji, it's a different skin color. Why is it it's a biracial emoji? Different skin color crying than with this one. This motherfucker is crying at his phone going, <laughs> hey, you fucker, I guess you don't want anything to do with me. Bitch, answer me. I love the aggression. It's built up. There's a reason therapy exists. I would, it'd be funny if she did, did answer. Like, Sorry, my phone was dead. Six months later, I'm jealous of your heart. Why? <laughs> it's pumping inside of you and I'm not. Sorry, that was a very distasteful thing to say. Guys, gotta stop with the soft blow. You gotta stop apologizing. You gotta go off bold. I'm telling you guys, if you're gonna say something bold, add an emoji, okay? The emoji is the difference between you going to jail or not, all right? Because had it have been this guy again, be fine. Ooh, this is a Snapchat one. Snapchat is wild, so here we go. Sorry we never hung out. It's just the whole condom thing sucks because I can't give hard, because I can't stay hard with them on. And since you can't give BJ's, it wasn't really going to be fun for us. I mean, that, that motherfucker just walked in the room with a suicide vest and was like, we're all going down in this message. He said, fuck everybody. He's like, hey, I don't get hard. Fuck condoms and you suck it head. Who's winning here? Nobody. Okay, here we go. First text. Still sick? Them. I can't breathe out of my nose and mother nature is here. You should bring me chocolate. Damn it, can we make a deal? Depends on the deal. 
You ask for a BJ, I might just punch you. Never mind. Classic. But also, you don't want to get head from a sick girl. She sneezes on you, chops your dick off, and why not chew? That's terrifying. I'm not doing that. Here we go. This is a uh, fun text here. Let me murder that pussy. Shit, did you block me? <laughs> well, I mean, the best case scenario, you only got blocked, right? You said murder and pussy in the same sentence and you're not in federal county jail. Oh, I've seen this one. Get original, Brian. Let's say your left leg is Thanksgiving, your right leg is Christmas. Would you let me spend a little bit of time between the holidays? No response. You must not celebrate the holidays. The weirdest part about Thanksgiving and Christmas, if you're thinking about family or with family, you don't want to think about fucking. If we had the Thanksgiving table, be like, damn, I am horny as shit right now. Plus, he said this January 30th. Like, that's so far away, bro. You missed your opportunity. Two months late, you think this chick's gonna be like, oh yeah, Thanksgiving. So how freaky are you? Or are you like a dead fish? It's 10.30 on a Tuesday morning, Connor. Could you like chill? So she's a dead fish. That's a, such a dead fish answer. But also, Connor, chill. I was reading about comets today. It said Haley only comes once every 77 years. I'd like to change that. Let me tap that asteroid. Hit me up. Put the number. Bold as fuck. But look at the name. Giancarlo? I mean, he didn't even need to put that whole thing about Haley's comet coming. Had his name been like John, I'd be like, call the cops. Giancarlo? I'm like, good taste. That's all of them. Well, I just answered all the fuckboy texts, snaps, bumbles, swipes, writes, all that. You guys simply jerk off. Stay off your phone. Thank you.